Welcome, in this video we will learn about first machine learning program. The 6 lines of python is all it takes to write your first machine learning program. Just don't expect that in first machine learning program, we will do something related to artificial intelligence or something like that. We will do related to artificial intelligence only that is decision making but not that high end. So in this program, we will consider two objects that is apple and orange. So here in this image, you can see the differentiation. I am declaring two features as weight and texture and finding out the data depend on supervised learning data. So open my directory. If you have not yet downloaded all programs folder for this course, then do check the previous lecture in this course. A separate lecture in which I have mentioned a link to download all the program related to this course. So in that you will get the program that is first one dot py. So the first what you can see here is so before we begin program I would like to mention what we are going to do in this program. What we are going to do basically is here you can see in this image there are apples or oranges with bumpy surface and smooth surface with different weights. What we will basically do is we will just declare all four objects that is apple and oranges and after that we will label apple for 0 and 1 for orange and after that we will demand we want which one is the object which has 150 gram weight and it has a bumpy or smooth surface. If we ask for 150 gram and bumpy surface, then it should show that it's a orange what we are asking for. And if you ask for 170 gram and bumpy surface, it should again show orange. Instead of that, if we ask 140 gram and smooth surface, it should show that it's an apple. So, in this way, depending on the feature, the program should tell us which object we are looking for. Pretty much simple program. So, let's open first one.py program. So, first we are importing from sklearn import re that is. The science kit learn is a collection of python modules relevant to machine or statistical learning and data mining. So we have imported it. After that, let me declare the feature here. I am using integer data instead of string. So we will write features equals to 141, 131, 150, 170. So this is 140 gram. And 1 stands for smooth surface and 130 gram, 1 again stands for smooth surface and for bumpy surface I am using 0. So 150 gram and bumpy surface that is orange, 170 gram bumpy surface that is orange. So this much is done, we have declared 4 objects. So here next we will do labeling for apples and oranges. So for the labels are my objects for apple and orange. So here I am using 0 for apple that is 2 0 apple and 2 1 for 2 oranges. Next we will declare empty decision tree classifier that is CLF is equal to tree dot decision tree classifier. It is unknown apple and orange here. Next, I am using training algorithm in classifier object as a features and labels. We have trained classifier now. That is clf equal to clf dot fit features dot labels. As features and labels, we have trained classifier now. So, if you are not getting what is this trained classifier, what I am saying, and what is this tree classifier? Then do watch previous videos in this course, you will get idea. If not it, no need to worry. By seeing how it works, you will get idea 
what it does. So we'll print out CLF that is training algorithm dot predict. We want to predict 150 gram. It should have 150 gram weight and it should have a bumpy surface. So we know 150 gram and the bumpy surface is orange itself only. So the output of this one should be the orange that is 1. So let's move to the output now. Open the terminal. Run the command as python space first one dot py. The output is 1. It predicts output as 1. That is, it's a bumpy and 150 gram. It should be orange itself only. So this is how we can see that our supervised learning works. So that's it in this video on the first machine learning program. If you didn't get what I'm saying in this video, please do watch it again and again until you understand it. Thank you for watching this video.